I feel like I'm blending it to the wall right now. But that's fine. Right, I think I think it's I think it should be okay. Hi guys. Like I feel like I have energy, but my brain is a bit scrambled at the moment. Scrambled eggs. If you're new to this channel, please subscribe. You know, if you'd like to join the family. I don't want to force you to subscribe, but if you're interested, the button down there. Um, anyway, so I have been sent some goodies from Gymshark. Um, just a heads up, this is not sponsored in any way. They just literally gifted me some of their new items. And I'm so excited to show you guys because I actually... I'll say, I'm pretty impressed. Okay, so let's get started. I just want to give you guys like a bit of a reference of my height and measurements. Everything that I got is a size small and I am 5'1 and a half, maybe 5'2 on a good day. <laughs> I typically wear a size 8 overall, sometimes a size 6. So size 6 to 8, you can go for a size small. Yeah, so just be wary because sometimes you might have to size up if you're in between sizes. Yeah, that's just a heads up. Because they do run a bit tight, I would say. So this isn't part of the new collection, but I just thought I would include it in here because they did send it to me. And they sent me, actually I chose this because I was allowed to choose a few items for myself and then they were going to send me some of the new collection as well. So I chose the Adapt Camo. <sighs> I'm so excited about this because I've always wanted a camo set. Guys, I freaking love the fit of this. I just, I'm obsessed. <laughs> I love this part. I love like the shaping. What do you call this? Like a V type of style neckline. You know, I just love the detailing on the back because... You know, sometimes it's nice to have some crisscrossy patterns in the back to add a little bit of something something to, you know, your gym outfit. I actually really love this, I'm not gonna lie. Like, <sighs> and I would say the support of this is so good. It's high quality support because I've tried jumping around in it. Nothing was like flopping around or anything like that, which is great. I would rate the material like an 8.5 out of 10. It's not as stretchy, I would say. It was actually really difficult to get into. Like, I mean, I might stretch it out a little bit in like a few months because it is pretty fresh, pretty brand new. So yeah, I would consider it not as stretchy, but I mean, it's okay for it to not be stretchy. I don't want it to be too stretchy because obviously you want it to fully hug your body and support you. So I wore this two together, I think yesterday. You guys, I freaking love the leggings. I was so excited about the leggings because I've always wanted camo leggings. And I got it. I was so freaking happy. Like, I have my Okay, so with this, I would say it's not as, like, buttery soft, I guess. It's more, like, firm. <laughs> I don't know how to explain it, but it's not as stretchy. But it lifts your booty up higher um but yeah i worked out in it it is squat proof with a lot of dark colors it tends to be more squat proof compared to the lighter colors anyway so that's if you get the black one the black one is definitely squat proof and i love that the shorts i've already worn this like a few times already because i love it that much like it's just it's a staple because <laughs> i'm more of like a shorts person as opposed to a leggings person Simply because it's just so much easier to work out in. And when I wear shorts and when I get sweaty, it's easy to just put on. When I'm wearing when when I'm wearing leggings and I sweat, it's so hard. It's hard. You ladies know how hard it is to get the leggings up with sweaty legs. I know it's TMI, but it's just it's just a trip. Okay, so the next is Adapt Animal. I got the purple and I also got the black of the animal <laughs> of the Adapt Animal. It's similar to the Adapt camo literally got the same kind of crisscross thing at the back which is cool i like that anyway so no complaints and this is more of like a high neck sort of vibe which i like i actually really like it it kind of complements my shoulders really well i'm gonna be honest this was so hard to get on because it's just so stiff but i can get used to it i literally have to like shove my face into it this top i was kind of surprised when i saw it i was like "Ooh, okay i did not expect this at all. I kind of love it though. The thing is I would not wear it zipped up because I literally could not breathe when I tried zipping it up like Excuse me. I would like as much air coming into my skin as much as possible when I'm working out I felt kind of suffocated when I zipped it up. I'm not gonna lie So I'm definitely gonna keep it open and you have to wear some sort of padding with this a sports bra or something because it's It doesn't have any padding at all. This was so much easier to get on compared to this sports bra, but you know, it is what it is. I've worn this a couple times already, and I freaking love it. It's like 
so much more stretchier than the Adapt Camo Leggings. If you're a bit self-conscious with, you know, your bloated stomach, I would recommend this specific line because it actually covers up very well. For me, like I wore it last week and I was feeling very bloated because I had period bloating. I wore this and I felt so comfortable and confident because it didn't protrude my fluffiness, if that makes sense. It didn't accentuate, you know, the stomach kind of hanging out. Definitely would gravitate towards this if I have those days where I don't feel my most best self, if that makes sense. Um, it's squat proof. We love squat proof. I did wear it on squat day. I did, I did wear it. Couldn't see anything. It is a nine out of 10 for me, actually. It is up there. Mm. Yeah. Anyway. I'm actually really happy they gave me a purple one because I actually don't own any purple active wear. So I'm just like, yay, I get to try something new, try a different color. Actually, I'm like, I do have purple, but a different kind of purple, a different shade of purple. <laughs> this obviously is the same style as the black sports bra. I don't know what kind of neckline it is. It's just like a high neckline. I have yet to try this, but I actually, I was surprised. I was pleasantly surprised. And I like the fact that it's got a scrunch bum because it adds like a little bit of, you know, shape to the butt. It's not the full on scrunch bums. I don't personally love the full scrunch bum in between your butt cheeks because I tried that before. It just does not look good, like on my butt just don't like that so I was like okay this is not too crazy scrunch butt so <laughs> it kind of sits a bit above my actual butt but it does kind of help with forming that line in between your butt cheeks <laughs> so I mean that's what the thing is these days having the you know the line in between your butt cheeks to separate the butt cheeks so yeah I'm glad it does separate my butt cheeks that's that's the perk of it and it's comfy in terms of the quality it's very thick it's very sturdy I feel like it'll last few years active wear can get really expensive so if you have to invest in something you'd want to invest in something that's like of high quality and you want it to last you ages and I feel like this is gonna last me so long because of the quality it's just like so thick and sturdy and I love that we'd love to see it for me I think I actually would recommend the leggings more than I would for once. I actually recommend the leggings more than I would the shorts because I don't know, it's something about the leggings is just chef's kiss. Guys, when I saw this, I was like, Are you kidding me? Just look at it. Look at how beautiful it is. I just love the back. The back is what got me. Look at that. These tags are really annoying. And you can take it off. There's like different ways of wearing it. I'm like, cool. How sick is that? I've never owned anything where you can detach to make it a different look. <laughs> you can change it mid-workout. <laughs> the thing with this is, is that you would definitely need to wear some sort of padding. I would not wear it when I'm doing anything extensive. But yeah, if you have any jumping around to do, I would not recommend wearing it because it's very minimal support. It literally says it in the name. Minimal sports bra. I'll write this. A 9 out of 10 just simply because it looks so nice. <laughs> Sad because it's see-through. That's the only thing that really just kind of ruins it for me. I have to slip in some pads so that you don't see anything. But that's okay. Next, the seamless adapt fleck. This is so nice. I'm obsessed with the color. I'm pretty sure it's um coconut white. I don't own any color like this. I love the little detailing of the specs. It adds a little bit of something to it rather than it just being like a plain print if that makes sense if it's just like plain flat nothingness it's got two layers in it so it's very compact friendly is that the right word oh, i'm freaking love this stuff so much like i do i do i do i do like i love how it's double layered and like adds something something adds texture just you know to a regular sports bra the sports bra i love how thick it is like it's just Do I have any other words other than good? It's great. <laughs> Did I do a light spread? So the leggings are hella see-through. I would say please do not wear this on lower body day. You can wear it upper body on upper body day. Not squat proof. Sad about it, but I mean it's kind of hard to get white colored squat proof leggings anyways. You can see my undies here. I'm wearing seamless. But you can still see it, but that's okay. If you know a place we can get squat proof white leggings, please let, let us know, okay? Wear nude undies, please. Nude undies, that's the only thing I feel like will go with this. 
my battery's dying and we need to get going. And the long sleeves, I literally blend in to the wall. <laughs> Can't go wrong with long sleeves, but like honestly for me, I don't like working out in long sleeves because I get too hot and bothered. So this is probably just going to be like a lounge around top for me. It's stretchy, which I like. I don't like to feel constricted with my clothes. I mean, I don't really, I don't know. I feel icky when I feel material on top of me when I'm sweating. I don't know, it's like a random scrunch on the back, like a scrunch bum, but for the back. It doesn't really do anything to be honest. It's literally just for the look. I don't understand it, but it's okay. No judgment. We don't judge around here. And I also got the pink. Pleasantly surprised with the pink, I'm not going to lie. Not really much of a pink person, but I don't mind it. It probably would not be my go-to, to be honest. It's just because I don't like pink. So if you like pink, you, you'll like this. It's just I don't like pink that much. I highly recommend the sports bras because it's very flattering on for me. I personally love the skinny straps. Oh, we love this, the strappy back. Honestly, love strappy backs. Like, it's been a thing of mine lately. I just love all of my sports bras to have the strappy back because it adds a little bit of mm, to, you know, your back. <laughs> okay, with the leggings, I'm going to be honest, it's not my favorite pair of leggings. It doesn't really do much for my butt. It doesn't have, you know, much flattering bits to it so that, you know, to help scoop it up a little bit so if you're looking for something that you know kind of flatters your butt more probably go for the adapt animal even adapt camo is really good i really like that on my butt because the structure of it kind of molds your glutes together so that it looks perky with this yeah not really it's just like not really giving the shape that i want that's me being honest it's just not as stretchy as adapt animal i found i find that this line specifically is a bit more like stiff yeah so overall i'd probably rate this collection like a i'll say like a seven out of ten sports bras is a big fat yes for me but the leggings is probably a no coconut white i probably would wear i really like the color of it that's why the lighting keeps changing i love this one this is literally my favorite one of my favorite things that i got from this entire thing it's just so versatile i'm so happy that it's not see-through the padding is really thick so if you're thinking of getting this specific sports bra don't hesitate because honestly it is not see-through at all you cannot see anything i love it <laughs> okay my battery's gonna die thank you so much for watching please like if you like the video leave any comments any suggestions that anyone might find helpful if you have any questions also leave that down below and i'll see you guys in my next video bye